everybody, this is Connie Whitlock with On KC Metro, and Fred and I are here to wish you a very Merry Thanksgiving. I think, okay, can you do a Merry Thanksgiving? Well, we are. At the end of this spot, we are going to tell you what year was the first Thanksgiving in Kansas City and what they probably ate. You will be surprised, and maybe not. I don't know. Okay, guys, first up, sustainable market shopping event. Support small businesses while shopping for the holidays. This Saturday, November 25th from 12 to 4 p.m., Do Good Company is hosting a sustainability market where everything you find makes the world a better place. Find fair trade artisan made and organic products for everyone on your shopping list. From hand knit children's toys from artisans in Bangladesh to organic beauty products and holiday gift tags that donate meals to children around the world. Every high quality item has been has a story behind it and you can feel confident that your purchases will make the world a better place. This year's vendors include Crochet Kids, Beauty Counter, Pebble Child, Purpose Jewelry, Noonday Collections by Grace Designs, The Arise Box, Muchana, Yume, and Love Light Paper. That's right. Go shopping and support the world. Mm, that's going to be a great. Next up, this Sunday, November 26th, the Mengel Brothers Strings Duo, hosted by Raphael Hotel. Yes, go downtown Kansas City in the Plaza area on Sunday from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. on the Country Club Plaza. That's right. You go down there, and I think the lights are all going to be lit up. And it's going to be great, right, Fred? Yes. Here, a repertoire performed by the Mengel Brothers. The two are top classical musicians in the Kansas City area. Guests appreciate their fresh stylings on classical compositions, as well as riffs on jazz, pop, rock, and artists such as the Beatles and the Doors. Yes, we all know the music of the Beatles and the Doors, but they put a class classical twist to it. It's going to be amazing. Next up, Artist Open Studio. Go ahead and look it up on Facebook, Saturday, November 25th from 12 to 3. For $10, you can paint. That's right. Make a craft, paint, all ages, go there, have some fun. Yes, they even have a buy one, get one half off. Uh, I don't know what that exactly is for, but you can go find out because they have free popcorn. It's a popcorn bar, fresh baked cookies, and you're going to have a good time. I just know it. Okay, let's look down the calendar. Woo! December 31st, 6 p.m., and I don't know if I'm going to pronounce all these right, but if you want to eat like a king and ring in the new year for $170, $75, you can. So we'll see if I can pronounce all these. Let's, let's, we should do like a contest, a cushy New Year's Eve dinner, seven courses created by Chef Joe West, complimentary welcome co cocktail, complimentary champagne toast, and complimentary wine pairings. This is a lot of compliments. It's going to be great. First course, bay scallops, brown butter, yuzu kushu. Second course, bison tartar, nutris baronets, pickles. Third course, scallop balut, full gras foam, burnt miso. Fourth course, monkfish, smoked celery root, potato nochi. Fifth course, duck breast, auspicious spices, smoked honey. Sixth course, prime ribeye, bone marrow, marrow, sorry, wasabi root. Seventh course, coconut, passion fruit, custard, and the tickets are at cushy.talktix.com. That's right. So you can eat like a king. I'm thinking that might be a really good place for those of you that want to kind of propose, you know, get that ring out. Actually, that'd be kind of special, you know, fill her up and give her a lot of complimentary stuff. And there you go. Yep. Uh, I'm going to tell you, Kansas City had its first uh, Thanksgiving, apparently, in 1920, the Evening Public Ledger published an article on this, and this is what they're saying. So uh, they're they're claiming that 1856 was the first year officially in Kansas City that they uh, celebrated Thanksgiving, and they had onion soup. Barbecued of beef, no surprise there, succotash, pickles, roast duck, pepper cabbage, website pudding, don't ask, I don't know what that is, and tea and coffee. Woohoo! Okay, we can change the menu this year from turkey to barbecue beef, right? Yeah. Yeah, I think. 
think I think Fred's up for that. So anyway, I hope you guys all have a great Thanksgiving and uh, enjoy your family, enjoy the time together, and uh, and I'll see you next week on Monday. And it'll be Christmas season. The light will be out.